string validators in Hackerrank, although it's a Python, um, is a Python problem. So let's read it. Python has built-in string validation method for basic data. It can check if a string is composed of alphabetical characters, alphanumeric characters, digits, etc. Now, so now these are the methods. Each one is for the alphanumeric, is for the alphabets, is for the digits or numbers, is for the lower case or case. Now, over our time, the taxes you are given, you are given a string called S. This is the string called S here. Your task is to find out if the string S contains alphanumeric characters, alphabetical characters. Digits, lowercase and uppercase characters. Now, input format. A single line contains string S constraint. Zero, less, zero is less than length of S, less than 1000. Output. Now, in the first line, print true if S has any alphanumeric characters. Otherwise, print false. That means so, in first line, if, for instance, let's say we, let's say, the S now, um, we say we, we give, let's say we say S to be equals to, um, let's randomly A, A, J, A, J, 5. Now it says the first line, if this string now has an alphanumeric, as alphanumeric print false, it has so now to be like. First line will print true or it has alphanumeric characters. In the second line, if it has only alphabets, print true. It has alphabets, print true. If it has digits, any digits, there's five here, print true. If it has lowercase, you have lowercase, A is lowercase, print true. If it has uppercase, print true. Now, now this was an example here. This is QA2. Q has phonemeric. Q2 is phonemeric. It's true. It has alphabet. QA alphabet print true. It has um digit two is digit to print true. It has lowercase. Lower Q is lowercase to print true. True. Uppercase. A uppercase to print true. So that's how we are about to solve it. So we will write some, some functions of each of them using the for loop. All right. Having said that, let's let's jump and go. So I said earlier, I will I will, I will explain my code with comments in each line. All right. Okay, let's go down. So we will first of all we will, we will check if any character is alphanumeric. I will do. Then we will now check. Let's copy this. We we'll just copy this, okay? What we must check if any character is alphabet alphabetical. Would would check would check if any character is a digit. Would check or would check. If any character is lower case, we will check if character is upper case. So now this is what we want to do today. So let's write the code for each of them. Now check if character is numeric, numeric. So what's it? a print statement will print any 
character char is alphabet so down for char in s then this one will be print any char dot is alpha for char in s next one print any char dot is is digit for char in s print any char dot is lower case then for char in s and these sort sort of print any char dot is upper for char in s all right so i'm done with that let's run the code and see okay if you want to submit the code first five cases run thank you so much for watching my channel please remember to like comment or oh, comment subscribe see my next video